Well, in 2020, you gave us PTSD. Yeah. And, and now you're back with Survivor's Remorse. Yeah. Uh, which, uh, to my understanding, is a double album. Yeah, double side. Explain. A side, B side album. Um, 25 records. Really? Yeah, 25 records, 12 on the A side, 13 on B side. Okay. Um, Survivor's Remorse, in a nutshell, man, is me being able to be here, right here next to you, having these conversations and have survived and been through so much as an artist, you know, being in the game young and all the obstacles I had to overcome. And the remorse side of it is knowing that what it took to get here and everything that I lost along the way, all the people that I lost, you know what I'm saying? And that's important, so I, I have to acknowledge that. What is your perspective? Uh, they using lyrics yeah. against artists right now. Mm -hmm. uh, we've all seen what's happening right here in Fulton County with Young Thug and what's going on with him and, yeah. and that whole situation. With my brothers, what, man, free YSL. No doubt. What, what's your perspective on that? I think, in my opinion, it's art at the end of the day. I think freedom of speech, we should all have freedom of speech. We should all be able to express ourselves through our music. And necessarily, that don't mean that I'm out here committing crimes. I'm just uh, uh, a vessel for the people who don't have a voice. Uh, one of the things that I was also appreciative of in meeting you was how, you, I got another superpower, you are. you're a great dad. Yeah, yeah. That's <laughs> and you love being a dad. Natural. It come natural. <laughs> you guys. love being Thank a dad. You. Like, Thank so you. what is this whole <laughs> social media like thing with you like because sometimes you know there's you know you yeah. share the kids uh, how do you deal with social media if people know me naturally like if you really know me i'm i'm goofy i'm a goofy person <laughs> if i'm like a free spirit you know right. and for me being a dad is like that's a part that's not that don't have nothing to do with me being an artist it had nothing to do with me being g herbo but that's my life right. every day i'm with my kids i'm no i have to be a father before anything else i saw something that said one of the most dangerous occupations is being a rapper right now. Mm -hmm. um, you know, RIP to my brother PNB. Yeah. Uh, RIP, I could go on for like go hours on. and hours. Um, do you feel like you're a target? 100%. Being just being a regular person, going out, living life, you can't do that. And at the end of the day, we all humans. Like I just said, I don't have a superpower. I'm just as normal as anybody else. So I want to live a normal life sometimes, you feel me? And, it's hard, man. I'm gonna tell you who's unstoppable in the booth. This man right here.